Fuckers. We need Cassandra. Where the fuck is Solas? I don't know. I need help as well. <laughs> no, 
Now doing this without combat pausing is, I think, impossible. At least in Nightmare. That guy won't leave me alone. And now I have two of them on my back. I don't think it in this difficulty it can be done without combat pausing. Because <clears throat> positioning people doesn't work that well. Yeah. I will then pause combat uh, and try this again. <laughs> Let me O otherwise, I don't think it can be done. Let me r go back to here. This is where I said I would reload. That looks like a big rift. Mostly rage demons. These are no big concern. Okay, everyone is here. Let's get potions running. Let's wait until I heal. Those regeneration potions are quite useful for this type of situations. When you can expect a long ass fight. See what the rift has for us in the store.
guys are tough my own fault for several reasons and one was not getting my let me do something uh, yeah I don't really care I love this game Let me check some. I'm going to switch the position of my second monitor. If I can. In all honesty, I think that was the reason I died. Let me ch check. I should have done this a long time ago. Oof. Ah, it's true. Now it. And the good thing is I can. I can what? I can go and experience new stuff. Because I didn't do any of the missions, the main missions. <laughs> Okay, my second monitor is now up, not to my left. And that was a stupid thing I, I was doing because of my way of fighting. Let me try that fight with my... with my... monitor this way. So I'm pretty sure I killed myself with Cassandra when Cassandra couldn't escape. I don't think I can win the fight, but I don't believe I can escape the fight, or I could have. But Cassandra got stuck because I clicked outside. Holy shit! Great, the Oz. Now they are all running after me.
Okay. Okay, it seems this is the better way to do this. Yeah, I think I'm going to fight in the mountain now. And go and name that fucking bullshit. That guy I'm not going to be able to kill. That's for sure. Stay away, fucking bastards. Shit, he's coming. Let's aim this shit. Hopefully I do it before he gets here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Fucking bastard. I don't know what the hell he did to himself. But I do fear him. He just almost killed my ass. Why are you doing this? We already know we saw a future. Just <laughs> stop so we can talk. <laughs> That's the option for the libertarian mage supremacist. <laughs> If I were playing another character, I would definitely go with number three. Let's have a chat, my friend. I have no idea, Charlie, how many. Okay. If I have to select one of these three options, I'm going with number one. This guy wants me dead. He has been ha hunting me in the present, the past, the future.
This is just grandstanding, but uh, whatever. You call timeout, uh, Poncho, why? Ah, you wanted someone to, to clear the chat, okay, no problem. <laughs> Let's go with this, then. <laughs> ah, Lass, it was you, it doesn't matter. Uh, are you still here, Lass? I think you're going to get the spoilers for the next few minutes. So I suggest uh, <laughs> you go. You're saying number three, the why? If you. This guy, this guy is hell bent on killing me. There is no compromise with him. It's been clear that for some reason I'm disrupting his plans. <laughs> so I, 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 with my libertarian supremacist mages, I would go with number three without even thinking about it. Uh, so I think it number one is the only, the only option, really. If you want to argue for number three, I'll give you a few, a few moments. This is this is crazy. How did this guy get so powerful? Well, he was already extremely powerful. Maybe he knows something about red lyrium and went hunting for it. That is conceivable, since the. The Taig was very, very far in the deep roads, and this and, and Corypheus seemed uh, uh, what? Corypheus seemed to be very, very, very familiar with Dwarven lands. I remember what he said when he when he awoke. He said. Be these dwarven line, la lands, why are the roads so empty? So maybe he knew something about those strange dwarves that worship Lyrium. Who knows? This is all crazy. A second. <laughs> no. No, the realistic role-playing approach is taken by Telltale Games. They only give you a few seconds to keep the conversation moving. Those are, don't, that is realistic. This is just for fun. Whatever you are, I'm not afraid. Words I am. mortals often hurl at the darkness. Once they were mine, they are always lies. What? No me. Know what you have pretended to be. Exalt the Elder One. The will that is Corypheus. You will kneel. <laughs> he still wants that. <laughs> he still wants that. No. No, we cannot show weakness. This is a mage, obviously, a powerful one, and he lets the Tevinters. This guy is really badass. He's awesome. I'm getting my thoughts. Corypheus, I just need to take all of this. Give me a sec, please. This guy, this guy is awesome. I find it interesting that they gave, they made libertarian options open, 
I remember in Dragon Age 2 I was so so angry because I wanted to help to help the apostates, the blood mages, and I couldn't. I always had to kill them. But here I always I can try to get an alliance with Corypheus. It's very unlikely he will accept because he appears to be under the impression I'm trying to supplant him as the god of, of, of whatever. The elder god, was it? Well, it doesn't matter. But this is a Elish elf. She will never bend her knee for at the winter mage. Never. You'll... you'll get nothing out of me! You will resist. You will always resist. It matters not. What the hell is that? I am here for your anchor. The process of removing it begins now. It is your fault, Herald. You interrupted a ritual years in the planning, and instead of dying, you stole its purpose. I do not know how you survived. But what marks you as touched, what you flail and rifts, I crafted to assault the very heaven. And you used the anchor to undo my work. The gore. I honestly don't know much about what's going on. Let's go and revive Cassandra. Holy shit! Well, as you can see, Ninjinsky not very good. That was a tough... Tough... A tough... Fight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, O'Neill. Wasn't that close? I have a little bit of tachycardia right now. All right. <laughs> okay. And that's why you undo rifts. What level am I? I'm level 16 on this character and level 15 on the rest. Problem is they spare demons. I could just get rid of the spare demons somehow. Let's return to a to a camp. <laughs> well, certainly mine is O'Neill. That was really fucking close.
You need to know when to pull out. Let the skies boil! Let the world be red to sunder! Well, they just made Corifus more powerful than I. Isn't that great? <laughs> Holy fuck. Let's see if I can find a supply cache. Is no, I won't. Shit, he's back to full health. I will not get full. Okay, thanks, Asterix. Let's go. At least he lost half his life again. Somehow, shit! The breach is getting bigger! It will endanger the world! We must stop this! of the Golden City, cross the ages. Dumat, ancient ones, I beseech you. If you exist, if you ever truly existed, aid me now. Isn't the Inquisitor an asshole? <laughs> So 
Solus. Your... Are you sure? We could take the pieces, try to... That would not recover what has been lost. There's more, isn't there? It was not supposed to happen this way. No matter what comes, I want you to know you shall always have my respect. Inquisitor, are you alive? What the hell? Fucking Solus was involved in this after all. What was that? Thanks, Punch and Nutter. We won, and the sky is healed, healthy, whole. There's just that left to remember. Looks that way. What do we do now? We kill all the humans. <laughs> Fucking bastard, he took my gear. We go back to Skyhold. And I didn't even need to use my focus abilities. <laughs> More fucking soulless. He wanted to tear the veil or Get rid of it. I knew. And he needed that freaking orb to do it. Yeah, obviously, Strix, this was not as difficult as that dragon I fought yesterday. That dragon got me on the ropes. This, this was not hard. Especially Corypheus. Once I could taunt him properly, uh, the game was over. The problem with dragons is that you cannot taunt dragons. So, if I could taunt dragons, pff, not even a level 30 dragon would withstand me. Well, he doesn't want to tear the veil, he wants to get rid of the veil. Uh, he, he wants... The veil is a, an artificial separation, that, that's what he believes, between the faith and the reality of mortals. And he believes there is a way to take the veil without destroying reality, so you can merge both. That's why I, I, I was always curious why, why he thought Corypheus was so fucking crazy. Or, but he didn't want to destroy the world. That's what he is like about the rifts. That rifts could destroy reality. <laughs> 